my friends so you want to do a mastermind and then create a course from that or you want to create a course and you're thinking okay what if I use a mastermind or a multi-week multi-session process where I actually record it and then create a course from it then I sell that right so you want to do that this is what we're going to be talking about I actually I'm going to be putting that together in the next few weeks and I need to kind of put the pieces together and we're going to talk about that as I do it so that you can do it too we're going to get to that in just a second but first this so the real question is this what are the strategies techniques and tools that you need to learn to generate residual income from the e-learning boom that's happening right now my name is Jean-Serge Gagnon and welcome to Course Income Secrets a lot of leaders do that right they create these courses and that's actually a lot of what's taught right what is taught is to have an idea for a course and don't create the course before you sell it actually tell talk to your audience find out what they're really interested in and there's all sorts of strategies around that like creating a Facebook books a Facebook group or maybe LinkedIn or other other platforms but creating a group where you ask people questions specific to what you're going to teach and then put together a course based on that or you do a live a, a set of live sessions that you then turn into a mastermind course or just a course right depending on what it is and my intention is that in 2021 I will be creating one of those I'm going to be doing a, a live set of live sessions that will have a specific goal for you and that that some well not just you but anybody else who's obviously interested in the topic that's going to then turn into a course that I will then sell afterwards right so but the thing is that I can't create a course without knowing what people want right so the first thing you got to do is you got to figure out what people want and in my case I've been building uh online the uh, online uh, audiences I've been doing uh, all sorts of different things and one of the things I've done is I've created a 12-step guide and I've I'm seeing lots of people getting that guide trying to figure out what what it is and I've also done the 12 steps I mean if you look behind me right there those are I don't know if you can see but those are whoops those are the 12 steps in that 12 step guide right and that's one of the things that I've been um, really toying around the idea of doing is actually doing a mastermind where there's 12 sessions where we talk about these different uh, topics and get re get you really clear on what you want to do but how do you get there how do you get to the point where you have your mastermind ready and you're ready to go so let's just talk about the steps in the whole in this whole process of how you get there right let's just share the screen here uh, so on Facebook right you'll see people posting all sorts of different things you will see people on there actually posting about like here's here's a, a great example Ty Lopez this is this is a, a, a sponsored post obviously it's an ad so he's got this uh, this great bundle of things I saw another version of this which was basically um uh a, a picture with a bunch of different things in it right so he had that so he's got different ads going on unless I unless it's because I clicked on learn more maybe now let's just take a look at that uh well yeah he doesn't really he basically he's talking about getting the but anyways that's the point is like he did these kinds of masterminds right he did these kinds of sessions and he put these together eventually the other person that I uh, follow that does that is uh, Mark Lalonde and he's got the uh new what is it Hollywood uh social media whoops social if I can type right social media is the new Hollywood oh by the way if you're listening to the audio of this make sure you go check out the the live the video and the blog post at cis292 I believe it is is it let's make sure yes cis292 jsgagnon.com go check that out that's where you're going to find the video and the audio and the uh, blog post all right so this is a great example of um something that uh, Mark Lalonde did using this exact model right he created this this course this 12 this one was a 12 session course that were basically 12 weeks of webinars that I, I was actually in that in that uh, set of uh, of um 
of sessions and basically it's just it's just going through I mean obviously he had a plan he had a sequence to go through he had he had that all thought out and then we did these sessions every week and he would show us certain things but then there was also interaction there were questions and things like that throughout the whole thing and at the end you end up with this course that he's selling for five thousand dollars right is that the, can I see the price here I actually have it because I was part of the original but he's selling it for five thousand dollars right so that's that's what I want you for you is to be able to figure that out and put that together so let's start with notes here let's go into notes so the first thing the first thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to have a topic right you need a topic number one is so let's just say to create a mastermind whoops mastermind that will become a course so number one you need a topic so you need a topic it's the same thing as anything else it's it's like when you're talking about selling something online you got to have a one thing got to have one thing that is what the reason why people will want to attend will want to join up will want to buy afterwards that one thing what is it what is the topic and then the end result I guess it comes down to the end result that you want for your student for your your attendee for your buyer right what is it that you want them to accomplish right so for me I got to figure out what I want to accomplish at the end of my mastermind right so maybe my 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 well I still have to think that through uh, and I'm not even sure if it's going to be about the 12 steps I have behind me there or if it's going to be something about uh, the perfect webinar I've been thinking about the perfect webinar right so have your first webinar right maybe that's let's do that let's just assume that that's what my uh, is going to be right so um the top so so the topic or let's just say the one thing right so that would be for example um uh let's just say for me let's just put that here okay so for me it would be um your so it's it's going to be um your first your first live webinar with um with the perfect webinar webinar framework okay so let's just say that that's what I want people to accomplish at the end of this the 12 weeks right so that's and and then and yeah so maybe before even that we've got to decide so length of of uh so length of mm, live live uh sessions right so what's the length of the live sessions that you're going to have for me I'm thinking 10 or 12 weeks right so 10 to 12 weeks it might be that I'm going to advertise 10 weeks and then I have two extra bonus weeks at the end or something right um <clears throat> two bonus sessions that's probably what I'm going to do so I'm going to have I'm going to advertise so I'm I'm going to so advertise advertise 10 weeks and add two new two new weeks at end if it works out works out is needed and participants want it which typically they will right because they're gonna they've paid for this right and the other thing you got to decide too is how are you well you don't really have to decide but you should have you will have a plan of selling this mastermind or this this live live training right <clears throat> so um okay so yeah so length and that's number two I guess the topic the one thing so the one thing that's not the one thing by the way that's the thing you want them to accomplish at the end but that's not necessarily the one thing right so the one thing is like this phrase of how to right so how to you know so how to whoops let's make these underscores how to blank without blank right so um so maybe my one thing is actually how to um how to host a successful well actually how to make your first sales how to make your first sales with a webinar without 
uh, without without stressing stressing out about um, if you're doing it you're doing it right so I don't know well, uh, how does that sound does that sound something that might work right how to make your first sales with a webinar without stressing out about if you're doing it right I mean that's definitely one of the things that I stressed out about when I was first doing my webinars is you know because there's so many different frameworks so many different ways to do it how do you know what is the right way to do it right so that's basically uh you got to kind of come up and, and I'm probably going to brainstorm on that some more right so then the other thing is number three you gotta f you got and I don't know if it's number three or if it's just you know one of those things that you got to figure out but your uh session titles topics right your session titles topics right so if you know what the end result is that you want your participants to get what are the things that they need to know to get there right so maybe before you even decide that you got to decide you definitely have to decide um so decide who your target market and avatar avatar is right so in other words it, depending on who your target market is it'll affect your sessions right because for example if you're targeting people who've never done anything online who are just starting out who don't know anything about uh, online marketing you're going to be probably creating content around how to set up your social media profile how to set up your pixels how to create funnels how to how to do all these different things that you need to do to actually build something and and promote it right whereas if your uh, target market is people who've done um even uh, sold courses who've had some income some success who know how to what a funnel is and how how what pixels are and where to get them how to set that up who's got a blog who's who <laughs> understand all these different things well you don't necessarily you won't need to go into the details of those things right so you'll be more more able to talk more about the advanced stuff right so <laughs> so that's why you need to decide who your avatar is so we'll put that as number three oh, oh sorry about that okay so yeah so then uh your session titles and topics so now the most I guess the next thing is you got to decide what each of the different sessions are going to be to get you to that final result now that's something that is easier if you're experience in teaching and 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 you've done some some courses that have had success right uh or if you like to teach or you it's just something that it's in you like me I I'm not necessarily a teacher but I've always liked to explain things to people and I like to figure out how to ex how to explain things to people and for me it's just a question of going from a to z right it's just a b c they're just steps towards the end result but how do you how do you get to the beginning which is the start of the knowledge what knowledge does the person have when we talk about documenting for example we talk about your um, your audience right who is the audience who what do they know what do they not know what do they need to discover what what do you need to teach them what do you need to tell them and explain to them how much detail do you need to go into certain things to get to the end result right the end result which is whatever your one thing is right in this case in my case here in this example is how to make your first sales I want you to make your first sales with a webinar I want you to do a webinar and have some sales so how do we get to that point right how do we get you to the point of first doing a webinar right so that means you have to prepare your webinar so let's just uh, write that down so we need so we need to prepare webinar slides right we need to uh, create a funnel a funnel uh, or let's just say a registration page registration page uh, we need to um, uh, connect with uh, audience so how do you connect with the audience right how do you get people to uh, to 
load up that so uh what else let me see was that I was actually downloading something here look at that it finished downloading <laughs> so I was actually downloading a and anyways whatever I was downloading something I didn't realize I, I thought I paused it so connect with your audience what else do you need you need to be able to um so you need to 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 so preparing your webinar slides is is going to be uh probably more than one session in my case right so it'll be there's going to be um initial layout right then there's going to be this the value ladder uh no actually not the value ladder it's going to be a stack this stack the stack and offer right offer and then there's going to be uh the stories what are the stories so maybe three sessions on the actual preparation of the webinar itself sorry my eye is bothering me so three sessions on that so that means I've got four I got three four five right I got four whoops oh my eye. I got five sessions out of 12 if I want to do 10 or 12 so uh create a registration page connect with your audience now the other thing we could talk about is doing ads doing ads to um get registrations right we can do ads to get registrations now that's a whole process in itself because you can't you can't just do an ad to get people to your registration that that typically doesn't work that I've, I know I've done it I've tried a lot tried a lot of different kinds of ads right so that's one of the things uh what else the other thing is you want to well and, and like I said that's in my particular case right so by the way your length of your live sessions also is you got to figure out are they going to be one hour sessions are they going to be two hour sessions you know it it's really up to you every single session has to be and that's that is a long process right okay so the other thing is you got to figure out so how do you figure out your sessions too right the other way is uh your session titles topics your session let's just say your initial this will be your initial session titles topic right so the figure uh, decide this would be decide decide again right because it's all about deciding in the beginning it's deciding afterwards you have to um kind of uh, narrow it out right so because the next thing is ask what topics people are interested in right so how do you do that right there's lots of different ways one of the ways is potentially create a group maybe maybe whoops maybe create a Facebook group and ask people when they join right so that's one way um so that's one way so may create a group and ask people when they join what are what is it they're interested in so you got to have a group that's related to whatever you're trying to uh, get as a result right this this particular result that I'm talking about here if you create a group around that so then you get people in that group and you start to have conversations with them now it's not a spam group it's not a group where you you start bugging people about everything you start telling people like me I created a, a webinar perfect webinar group I started to put a few friends in there and I'm, I'm trying to grow that and uh, it's part of what I'm doing right I'm trying to figure out how to help people to create their perfect webinar at the same time me I'm trying to do it for myself because I did do like eight sessions of one particular webinar that didn't really work out and I'm like okay well I guess I have to prepare a little bit more before I start doing these I gotta make sure I'm answering the right questions I gotta make sure I have the right stories I gotta make sure you know lots of things that I didn't really make sure oh, it's snowing pretty crazy out there right now but anyways yeah so and by the way if you see this right now uh, before Christmas you might see this before Christmas or maybe you're going to see it after Christmas either way I'd love for you to subscribe to my YouTube channel if you're seeing this on YouTube or uh, like my Facebook page if you're seeing this on Facebook okay so um okay so next is ask the top oh, top this is what is that topics topics people are interested in maybe create a group 
so let's just say create a group just create a group create a group and do it start that way that's one way you can also uh post something like like if I was to do a training on x what would be your um first question what would what what would you want to know about that topic okay something like that right so I can actually do that what would you want to what would you what would you want to know about that topic okay so if I was to do a training on x what would you want to do as a, as a topic right so I can actually post that I let's post that right now see if, I don't know if I'll get any responses but let's just do this let's go into my Facebook page right here and let's just post that right here let's just go in here and just say this if I was to do a train whoops I guess there's a eye missing there on um, let's uh um on um, and let's get that in here too how to make your first sale all right let's see that if I was to do a training on how to do how to make your first sales with a webinar without stressing out about if you're doing it right what would you want to know about about it would you be interested in attending live would you rather buy it after it's released okay let's see these are three questions let's just see what happens if I do that I'm just going to post that like that it doesn't really matter so just post that question and see whether you get any uh, answers oh there's the ad from Ty Lopez right here the the ad with all the different different things on it um okay let's go back to here all right so now the next part is how are you going to get people into your live mastermind so number six is how to get people in the live mastermind so the first you need to decide on a schedule right you need to say when is it starting you got to make a decision on the date that it's starting and then you have to start selling people into it so you can you could have free access to it but I wouldn't recommend free access because if you if you don't even sell it you you you're not you're telling people that it's not really worth anything right so what I would recommend is I would say that you have to choose a price for that right you choose a price for it and then you discount it in the beginning so one of the things that I've um so sell for high price whoops oh, I actually I uh, where did I say that if I post something like if I was to do a training oh there it is there's the typo let's save this file okay sell for high price so typically one to five thousand depending on your you know your big experience your background how long you've been doing online stuff and at the same time there's also the concept of you know you have to be willing to be tell people you're worth a lot don't be afraid to tell people you're worth a lot I mean your time is worth something so me I'm gonna sell mine at two thousand right so I'll sell mine at 2000 right so that's what I'm going to do um then you discount it discount it extremely extremely high so and you do that by number of people right so for me I'm actually going to go at $49 for first five people then I'm going to do let's just make that 
so I'm going to do that let's just put that on the separate line then I'm going to do 99 for next whoops for next 10 right so I'm going to have 15 people at that price point right then I'm going to do uh, 149 for next 10 maybe I should do 10 at 49 yeah let's do 10 actually I'd rather just the five that that way it's 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 a lot more like let's just do it let's go right so uh 149 and then it's going to be 199 for next 20. <clears throat> okay so that's what I'm uh let's see do I go higher let's go to 249 for next 20 people so that'll give me so that'll be 20 40 50 65 and then 299 let's do the 299 for next 50 so no 40 people so that'll give me 100 right so that'll give me 100 people in there so 40 60 80 90 oh no 105 I guess it'd be 35 35 people okay then after that it'd be a thousand bucks or two thousand I guess or maybe I'm going to make it a thousand right as a deal or something but that's going to be the price and that basically you do that using course coupons I'm going to show you how I do it out here I'm actually going to create this new course in clicky course so I'm going to make it a, a two thousand dollar course I have to go into here plus course I'm going to call this uh, webinar master um so what do I what would I be what would our master what would I call this webinar master um, oh perfect webinar master be a so become perfect webinar master okay so in this whoops learn the secrets of oh well, let's just let's just put my one thing in there right my one thing is how to make let's do that and then we're going to say in this live session and later the recordings you will learn all you need to know to know to become a perfect webinar master and sell and make your first sales sales with a webinar like the pros okay that's fine just whatever right so I just want a, a basic I'm not going to worry about the SEO yet or the hashtags uh, I'm not going to worry about the conversion bot I'm probably going to add that later on so I'm, I'm going to make this affiliate marketing obviously attraction marketing yes mm, course creation yes uh, what else could I make this not really sure but anyways I'll just use those for now and then um uh, then it's basically a course with no image oh sorry I, I clicked on done instead of uh, next let's go back to edit here okay so uh under price price it's two thousand dollars right two thousand now by the way I'm gonna give at least 75 percent commission to anybody who sells this at two thousand dollars right that's fine by me okay downloadable uh yeah sure make it downloadable embedded player no it's not going to be embedded the access is going to be I'm going to make it unlisted for now and well actually it could be public but okay anyways I'm going to put and I'm going to put it on all the sites okay let's say done <clears throat> okay so now I need a I need obviously a um I need a, a cover image let's uh, actually you know what let's go back and put the I know what I'm going to put I'm going to put the cover image from uh, from my other from my my from my uh where is it I think it's under under Russell Brunson perfect webinar right here yes there it is that one there <laughs> I'm going to put that guy there 
okay so that's going to be my image for the course I mean I'm probably going to change it but for now just to give you an idea so now I have a course that has no lessons in it yet <coughs> I'm sorry but I'm going to make a coupon for the first five people at 49 dollars right so I'm just going to go in here and I'm going to create a coupon I'm going to call it whatever it doesn't really matter 49 and it'll be 49 dollars and it'll be five submit there you go so now I have a coupon here and it's 49 dollars let's create another coupon 99 it's going to be 99 and there's going to be 10 10 of those right so now I mean if somebody wants one of these coupons I got to give them the link to it right um but that's basically the coupons now if somebody puts in let's just go to this actually this course has to be uh edit mm -mm -mm. access did I make it unlisted okay good now if I go and I load this course up in an incognito window oh actually I don't need to do that I can go like this I can go take this coupon here open link in incognito so now when I give this coupon to people right see the coupon there right oh you can't see it so the coupon up there right in the in the url I can just give this url to people and they're going to get this and they will say 49 dollars with the there's there's five of five right so they're going to see that there's only four or three or two left at that price right and they're going to know that they have to uh and by the way if you're listening to this go ahead and buy this if you're seeing this before I even promote it that would be fantastic if I actually sold these before even doing them right so go ahead if you see this this coupon that's right there and if there's still some people that have not bought it yet by the time you see this then yeah go right ahead it's fine by me because that's you really are going to be now there's going to be a date in this if you come here you're going to probably see a date of when it's actually going to go live or if you see it after after it's gone live obviously there won't this coupon won't be good anymore but if you you're going to see how much it is there might be a coupon maybe if you reach out to me there might be a way for you to get it at a great at a great deal but I doubt that it'll ever be less than the amounts I sold um, to anybody who uh where's that where's my it I, it won't be less than these prices right these prices are only for people who will be buying it before the mastermind actually takes place right so this I have to be promoting this and let's just for the fun of it take a look at my I guess I didn't have any comments on this did I uh <coughs> I don't know if Facebook's gonna update it no I didn't I didn't think I would because you know I <coughs> I just did that right now but yeah so that's kind of how okay so how to get people in mass so now we're gonna say how to get people in the live mastermind so you're gonna have to post regularly right so post post regularly about your mastermind remind them of the special special price and ask and ask them and have them ask you and have them ask you for their coupons right so I mean the thing is that the coupons and maybe they can be all you know they can all be I can make all these coupons public it doesn't really matter because the 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 the, the 49 coupon is only valid for the first five people right then the 99 coupon is only valid for the next 10 people so even if I nobody's going to use the 149 coupon if if they're still they can still use the 99 dollar one right so I mean that's maybe I just put that right in the description of the actual course yeah that's actually I'm going to do that let's close this let's go back to this other one and I'm actually going to go right ahead and edit this so this is going to be let's copy this let's put that in here so this will be this one right where's the other one and then this one here and by the way as you can see my name right here my user id is right there in the url that's because if you actually get an account on Click eCourse you can actually promote this with your <coughs> with your user instead of mine 
and if people go to this link with your user instead of mine you get a commission and the commission is always going to be based on whatever I decided the commission is and when we look at the course I said it was going to be what 75 percent did I 75 percent commission so that means that if you sell it for 50 bucks you're going to get 75 percent again but if you sell it for 250 you're going to get 75 percent of that etc cetera, etc cetera, right and that I'm doing that because you know my main goal is to get people in there it's not about making money from the actual uh because there's a lot there's a bigger purpose in what I do right but anyways yeah so that's definitely something that you can do if I go back into here I can say uh until the live session you can actually get this course at a huge discount with these coupons so let's go back here let's go into here I'm gonna just take this coupon here uh 49 dollars with uh, actually that's not what I want I want this here to be actually whoops what did I do no okay let's put that here and then make this a link whoops make this a link there we go and let's say 99 dollars with first five first five sales at next 10 sales next 10 sales at where's my coupons over here well actually let's just do this take this coupon right here and then take the link right and let's just do this make this a link paste that in there and submit now if I click on done now when I look at this course over here I can actually see that the coupons are there right first five sales 49 dollars I'm going to click on this and I get this 49 dollar or I get if if it says here there's no more uh, available right I can do this right now I get 99 dollars there's 10 out of 10 right so that's how how uh, you can use the coupons to kind of sell this at the beginning right I'm gonna have to obviously add some more details to this with the date and everything else but that's how you get a how you prepare this mastermind that's the basics of it I have to obviously spend a lot more time on all the details in here and I've, I've got to add some more uh, specifics to the to the lessons what am I going to be teaching that has to be inside the course description so people when they look at it they at least see what is this course going to be about what's the live session going to be about is it worth their time you know 12 weeks is a long time or 10 weeks right it's a long time to actually join and be part of this right so that's kind of what this is all about and yeah so hopefully you got some you got some ahas out of this and this will help you and I'd love to hear from you if you have any uh, comments or questions please go ahead and comment in the if you're watching the if you're in the blog post go ahead and comment below or in the video comment let me know what you got out of this if you have any other questions maybe that'll be a next episode of mine all right we'll see you in the next episode have yourself a great day this has been course income secrets the entrepreneur's blueprint to generating income from the e-learning boom. Some of your friends need to hear this message, so don't forget to share. For more content like this, go to CourseIncomeSecrets.com and make sure to subscribe and follow us here. My name is Jean-Serge Gagnon. Until next time.